Fox taking down, shot fired, and he rips one. Shot fired, goal for the Flames. There's a great save there by Ryan Reynolds. Elliot has it right now, great shot and goal by him. What's up guys, my name is Carter Elliott. I'm Garrett Cooper. And today we're gonna to take you on a facility tour. Let's go check it out. Here we are on our side of the building. We share the facility with women's lacrosse and women's field hockey. And we're gonna go check out our film room. So in the film room, we usually come here. Um, sometimes it's split between the offense and defense. Sometimes uh, the whole team is brought together and we just, we'll rewatch our games. We'll watch uh, game film on other teams and just kind of get prepared for uh, our next games. Yeah, a couple times a week, we'll come in here, watch our previous game, watch future games, teams that we'll be playing. If you'll follow us, we'll head to the locker room now. So all our facilities are badge access. So today, you guys are getting the VIP tour. Let's go. All right, well, just starting out, um, right as you walk in, you can see that, uh, you know, we have all the walls wrapped. Uh, I mean, if you look on the either side, I think on this side we have uh, our all-conference uh, teams where players have made it um, all throughout the years. And um, right on this wall over here, we have uh, our All-Americans. So it's, it's definitely really cool to see all the players that uh, have just gone through Liberty and just uh, had really great success with uh, lacrosse, uh, with the NCAA. Here at Liberty, um, we really value culture. So up on this wall over here, we have our team motto, which is um, with gratitude, we give, we grow, we grind, and ultimately we gain from all of those things. If you follow us right here, uh, one way that we can track uh, the gives, the grows, the grinds, uh, we have this board right here where we have a list of all the guys' names, and they can get nominated by either coaches or teammates uh, if they've done something especially well maybe that week, uh, whether it's staying late after practice, whether it's helping out a teammate, uh, they can get recognized for that and then they get a give, a grow, or a grind. And it's not just lacrosse related, it can be anything in life, um, outside of school, outside of lacrosse. Um, so it doesn't really matter, it's just furthering ourselves as men, uh, not just lacrosse players. Another thing that's super important about us uh, is our team verse, which is 1 Timothy 4.8. 1 Timothy 4.8 says, For physical training is of some value, but godliness has value in all things, um, holding promise for both the present life and the life to come. So that's big for us because it reminds us that we will actually gain more than just a sticker, as we were talking about earlier, but eternal life with God. Let's check out our Team equipment room. So this is our equipment room. Um, as you guys can see, uh, we got all sorts of stuff here. Um, just starting off, uh, we got our wall of helmets uh, that players have used uh, in the past year. We recently just bought uh, our brand new helmets for this next season, um, so that'll be pretty exciting. Um, on the wall behind you guys, we got uh, our heads, pads, um, which is usually a lot more stocked during the season, but mm -hmm. because it's summer, because it's off season, uh, we don't really need as much right now, but come springtime, we'll get her fully loaded. Um, and that's actually a pretty cool thing. Our coaches, they make sure that whenever we're walking around campus, we have lacrosse apparel to show off, to yeah. promote the sport, to get people to come to our games. And um, it's really neat because they always have stuff for us, whether it's jackets, shirts, shorts, sweatshirts, yeah. sweatpants. Yeah, we're provided with so much gear. I mean, we get all kinds of clothes when uh, new players show up. Obviously, they can use their own equipment, but we get shoulder pads, we get helmets, um, elbow pads, gloves, new sticks. Um, so we get really anything we could ask for. And uh, also, we we got stuff that we um, have for sale. We have a pro shop at our games that um, we um, sell team equipment, stuff like that. So like shirts, gloves. Um, I think we sell sticks. Um, we sell all sorts of hats and stuff. So another great space that we have here at our facility is the training room, so we'll go check that out now. So this is a really great space for uh, like game day activities. Um, we have a whole separate uh, club sports trainer. So for practices and stuff, we'll usually go there. If we're knocked up from 
a uh, week of long practice, but on game days we can come in here beforehand, get wrapped, get ice, um, anything we could really need to help us perform better. All right, after checking out our uh, facility, we're gonna go see our field. All right, guys, this is our field. Uh, we use it for practices, games, uh, shoot-arounds, uh, whatever we need it for, and we're just, mm -hmm. again, so grateful for it. Uh, and then, when it comes to game days, it's definitely more of an event than just an actual game day. And Yeah, we have a bunch of uh, staff working here um, to broadcast the game live. We have it on the uh, Liberty Flame Sports Network as well as ESPN+. Um, we have a crew that's behind the uh, scoreboard that you see um, that has flames going up every time um, there's a goal scored. We just recently, I believe just this year, got a video board that we're looking forward to using for uh, the uh, coming up games this year. So it's a big, it's it's a fun time um, for players and for fans. All right, and for our last stop on the tour, we're going to take you up to the uh, the press box. This is just an area for uh, whether it's alumni, parents. Uh, recruits uh, or sponsors even uh, to just come um, and just sit and watch the game. Uh, definitely it probably helps if it's super cold out. Um, this is a heated space and uh, it's definitely a great place to, uh, to watch our games. Thank you guys so much for joining us on our tour. Hoping to see you all this fall.